Welcome back. This time we're going to talk about people. People are always the focal point. If you have one person in a painting or drawing, they will be the focal point. The same is true for animals. If you have one animal in a painting or a drawing, they will be the focal point. This is even more reason for you to be careful in the placement of people in your paintings. Having them there creates an automatic focal point. Here's some examples. So you have a face here in an assortment of different blended areas. What do you see first? The eyes. That's automatic in most paintings. Same thing here. There's a massive amount of lines there. But what do you see the most? The eyes. People are automatic focal points. In this one, the eyes are closed. But then just having a person there creates that automatic focal point. There's a, an amalgamation of lines and textures, but just recognizing something in there that is a person creates your focal point. Even if the texture is all over and even on top of the eyes, the focal point is still the person. So here's your assignment. Create a painting with a person in it. You can work realistically or abstractly. See if you can hide that person in there. If you have time to try more than one, go ahead. The more you practice, the better you'll be. Have fun with this assignment and we'll see you in the next section.